Hi everyone, welcome to Wedra Studio. Today, we are going to talk about calcium. So now let's get straight to it. Calcium is an element that belongs to the alkaline earth metal group on the periodic table. With an atomic number of 20, a typical calcium atom has 20 protons, 20 neutrons, and 20 electrons. Did you know that calcium has been known since ancient times due to its presence in various minerals such as limestone and gypsum? It was historically used for various purposes, including construction and agriculture. However, the element was formally isolated and recognized as a distinct element by Sir Humphrey Davy in 1808. He named the element calcium after the Latin word calx, meaning lime, reflecting its association with lime and limestone. Calcium is the fifth most abundant element in Earth's crust. The most common calcium-containing mineral is calcium carbonate, found in limestone, chalk, and marble. Other significant sources include gypsum and fluorite. At room temperature, calcium is a shiny, silvery white solid metal. Its density of 1.55 grams per cubic centimeter is the lowest in its group. It is harder than lead but can be cut with a knife with effort. Calcium is a good conductor. The metal is ductile, meaning it can be drawn into thin wires. It is also malleable, allowing it to be hammered or pressed into various shapes. Calcium is highly reactive, especially with water and acids. It readily forms compounds with various elements and ions. Common calcium compounds include calcium carbonate, calcium chloride, and calcium sulfate. Did you know that calcium compounds are often used in fireworks? Calcium salts, such as calcium chloride or calcium sulfate, emit a distinctive orange-red color when burned. Calcium ions are responsible for the hardness of water. When water contains high levels of dissolved calcium ions, it can create scale buildup in pipes and appliances. Some marine organisms, such as certain species of jellyfish and algae, utilize calcium to produce bioluminescent light. Calcium ions play a role in activating the enzymes responsible for this phenomenon. Calcium has numerous industrial applications across various sectors. It is used as a reducing agent in the production of metals such as uranium, zirconium and thorium. In steelmaking, calcium is added as a deoxidizer and desulfurizing agent. It helps remove impurities like oxygen and sulfur, improving the quality and properties of the steel produced. In aluminum refining, calcium is sometimes added to aluminum alloys to improve their mechanical properties and enhance their castability. Did you know that calcium is essential for plant growth, playing a role in cell wall structure and stability? Calcium deficiency in plants can lead to disorders like blossom end rot in tomatoes and peppers. Calcium-containing fertilizers, such as calcium phosphate and calcium nitrate, are used to supplement soil calcium levels, improve soil structure, and enhance crop yields. Calcium compounds serve as raw materials in the production of various chemicals. For example, calcium chloride, used in de-icing, food processing, and drilling fluids. In medical imaging like X-ray and CT scans, the presence of calcium compounds in bones and tissues enhances the contrast between different structures, making it easier for healthcare professionals to identify any abnormalities. Calcium plays a crucial role in human health, particularly in bone formation, muscle function, and nerve transmission. Calcium supplements are widely used to prevent calcium deficiency-related conditions such as osteoporosis. However, it is not just the quantity of calcium intake that matters, but also its absorption, which is influenced by other factors like vitamin D levels and physical activity. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.